Hi everyone, it's Rich from Team P&W. Now with the addition of Orange Julius in our stores, we want to demonstrate a best practice to you. This video is going to show you how to brick your Arctic Rush machine with a conventional bricks cup and we'll also be using a refractometer. Using a bricks cup. First turn your simple syrup lancer unit to the off position. Tilt the lancer unit until the side arm engages the unit into the elevated position. Remove the cover of the Arctic Rush machine. Place the soda separator on the nozzle. The tan rubber end needs to cover the middle tip of the pop top nozzle. Place the bricks cup under the soda separator. The black rubber end needs to be inside of the small well of the bricks cup. Use the Lancer unit's manual fill switch to dispense and collect simple syrup to the bricks cup. Fill the syrup level in the smaller well to one ounce. Place the bricks cup on a flat surface and measure the water to syrup ratio. The level should be identical for the correct bricks level of 12 to 14. Replace the Arctic Rush machine cover. Release the swing arm and lower the Lancer unit to its original position, then turn the switch to autofill. Using a refractometer. Dispense a small amount of Arctic Rush slush into a cup. Clean the prism and the daylight cover with a damp, non-abrasive towel. It is important the Arctic Rush slush is completely melted. Grab a straw and use the straw to place a large drop of Arctic Rush solution on the prism. Be sure there are no air pockets and that the liquid covers the prism completely. Look into the scope and adjust focus if necessary. Read the number indicated at the shadow line. The bricks level should be in the range of 12 to 14. Again, clean the prism and the daylight cover with a damp, non-abrasive towel. Clean your work area and place the refractometer back into its case for safe storage. Correcting the bricks level. Remove the front cover to the simple syrup lancer unit. Locate the water flow control screw on the left side. Locate the syrup flow control screw on the right side. Using the Phillips head screwdriver, the flow of water or syrup can be adjusted. To decrease the flow, turn the screw clockwise. To increase the flow, turn the screw counterclockwise. Finally, snap the front cover back on. All right, now that you know how to brick your Arctic Rush machine, this will help you with consistency and quality of the Dairy Queen and Orange Julius products. Got it?